This sports segment of Naperville News 17 is brought to you by Naperville Bank and Trust. Frank Sinatra once saying, fly me to the moon, let me play among the stars. Well, Nico Valley's Kai Moon is the star in her matchup with the Huskies. Though Moon does know flying to the moon, she does fly into the basketball. Forces the turnover, and Megan Callahan puts her team up 13-6. Now here's Moon flying to the rim, capping off the footwork with the easy layup. But Naperville North getting sick of all these Frank Sinatra references. Laurel Pereira puts her team down by just two. However, by the fourth quarter, Moon becomes overwhelming, absorbing the bounce pass and trying her hand from three. 20 points from the Nequa star helps the Wildcats to a 7-1 conference record and a huge win, 62-46. Second half, um, I think we're more of a second half team. We come with a lot of energy and, um, you know, we put the, our foot on the gas and we don't stop and I think that showed tonight. A Flip it over to Matia Valley, where the New Year's resolution is to win its first game of 2016. Hosting Lake Park and looking like gym rats in January. The Mustangs off to a fast start. Sky Lane in the paint for two and an early lead. But as the quarter comes to a close, the Mustangs fading. That gym membership getting used less and less. A three at the buzzer as Jennifer Warfield gives Lake Park a four-point lead. Three-pointers, a common theme for Lake Park, who hits six more in the game and route to a 57-51 triumph. With one measly loss, the Warriors are the only hockey team in Illinois West enjoying a comfortable lead atop the standings. But for Nequa Valley and Naperville Central, every night is a battle for a top four spot. And on this night, they have to face each other with valuable points on the line. Wildcats just a point ahead of the Red Hawks, and now a goal ahead. Ryan Rutherford with a pretty play and one-handed shot. Then forward a minute, and it's Thomas Factor scooping up the mishandled puck and sending the puck home to its net where it belongs. Even Ryan Viola packing the puck's bags and sending it on a flight home as well. That's a third goal, and the lead Nequa never lets up. Wildcats win 5-1. to one. Good job, man. Proud of you. Switching sports and venues. Parkside lanes for Oswego and Wabonzi. Fans come to a sad realization that it's standing room only. Tough for them to see, but for Violet Kirk, it's easy as pie. What a smooth follow-through. Scores 212 the opening game, and Serenity Quintero even better. Total 674 with these masterful shots, which barely helps the Warriors to victory by less than 100 pins. Last mentioned goes to North Central women's basketball, who earned a convincing 98-75 win over Augustana. All right, that's your look at sports. Natalie, back to you.